This is where I think most of the gurus are wrong. Your income reliability depends upon the right tenant pool. And if you buy the property first, which is what most of the gurus advocate, you've auto selected the tenant pool. You've selected the maintenance costs. You've selected everything when you bought that property. It's not like you could buy the property and rent it to a different class of people. Every property auto selects a very narrow segment. For example, suppose you have a property and it's renting for $1,800 a month. Well, people are going to typically rent a property for at a maximum about one third of their gross household monthly income. So people who can only spend up to 1700 are going to eliminate your property from consideration. People are looking for a nicer property and they could spend 2000 are not going to look at your property. So every property only appeals to a very narrow segment. So by buying properties that match what your target tenant pool is willing and able to rent, you auto-select the tenant that you want.